I'm just here to let you know that you need to watch your back. Who sent you, Diamond? Jannard? I ain't telling you nothing else other than you need to keep your gun on you and don't get caught lacking. Why you want to help me? I got my reasons. We saw d Mac warning Tommy to watch his back, but we don't know why. Even Tommy was wondering why he was helping him. In this video, I'm going to talk about why d Mac seemed to be helping Tommy by giving him heads up. The guy Liliana kissed, how sustainable Dahlia is, the return of two beats, and if Tommy will kill Claudia soon. I will also touch on Adrienne if time allows me and of course if you are new to my channel you are welcome kindly hit the subscribe button for more power content if you are already subscribed thank you for the support now let's get straight into business first of all I want to touch on Liliana and this guy first before moving on to d Mark warning Tommy now we all expected Liliana to have a romantic relationship with Jennard following their previous interaction but in this episode, we saw Liliana opening the episode with a walkthrough to the club to introduce Dahlia to this dude here. Not typical of Liliana going to kiss people randomly, but this guy here is called Pelly. He happens to be Liliana's husband in real life, hence this intimate kiss. So those of you who didn't know, this is Liliana's real husband. It's his first time he has acted according to Liliana and he's not really an actor. He's acting. He's, he's acting. But I think he did great with this scene. And since they are both married, I guess they felt comfortable playing the scene together. And I also guess for decency's sake was the reason they made her husband play that role with her. Since there hasn't been any significant reason that was earlier established for Liliana to go introducing the drugs to men herself. Claudia's girls were already established to do that so if there is the need suddenly for Liliana to introduce the drugs, bringing her husband in wasn't out of place. I know some characters like Tommy, Ghost, Tasha and so forth are equally married and yet they play such romantic scenes. But while well, not every married couple will agree to break their vows for a movie. So basically that is that. Now moving on to why d Mark gave Tommy heads up is just one simple reason. The reason is his father. In as much as d Mark hates his father for some reasons, we all know he doesn't want him dead. Now d Mark was not only protecting Tommy by giving him heads up to watch his back. He was doing so to equally protect his father in the sense that if Tommy does his rounds and ends up with his father, who knows at what point Jennard might try hitting Tommy. And maybe Tommy would have been with JP when Jennard makes the move. Now, d Mark knows that Tommy can handle himself well when it comes to firing guns, but not his dad who will pick a bat instead. And like I said in my previous video, d Mark thinks Tommy and his father are lovers, so giving Tommy heads up to be always trapped even if he is with his father and something happens, he can protect him from getting hurt. This is why I think d Mark warned Tommy to watch his back. Now, let me know what you also think about what I just said. If you have any more reasons to why d Mark warned Tommy, leave it in the comment section below and let's get interactive. Now, moving on to how sustainable Dahlia is. If you ask me, this drug is not going to last longer. Why do I say so? Because it is purely scientific and only one person knows the formula which is Dr. Williams. Now, should anything happen to this doctor, that is end of story. So for Dahlia to survive for a long time, this doctor needs to be protected. Now, even if Liliana manages to learn the formula, there is no way she can make other options or reduce the quality like the doctor did. And Liliana might not fully comprehend the scientific makeup of Dahlia by just observing and asking the doctor questions. And mind you, it might not be everything the doctor will tell Liliana. And as time goes on, the doctor will become the weak link to Tommy's success. If she gets exposed as the one behind the drug, whoever wants Tommy gone in this business will take the doctor out first. Now let me know what you also think about what I just said in the comment section. Whether Dahlia is sustainable or not, leave your comment in the comment section. Let's get interactive. Now a lot of people are asking if 2 bit will come back to force. My opinion is yes. We will likely see 2 Beat making an appearance hopefully before this season ends. If you check the cast list for book 4, his name is Pat, hence he will surely make an appearance. I'm sure Tommy will need someone from New York to Chicago and we all know that Kate is not an option. 
Tariq is not an option either. Now, the only person Tommy can rely on in New York again is 2Bit. Cash is still a kid and I don't think Tommy wants him in that life. And he won't make Cash's father do any illegal moves for him because when he gets caught in the middle, Cash will end up alone. So the only person that can help Tommy will be 2Bit. Now, let me know your thoughts in the comment section and don't forget to like this video and also hit the subscribe button if you are new. Now, looking at the angle Claudia started playing, Tommy might not hesitate to put a bullet in her head if she gets too greedy. Her greediness is gradually becoming obvious that she is bad for business. I think Tommy is running out of patience with her and will end up using her and killing her. Now this lady Adrienne that Diamond is smashing was set up to be his problem. It's about broken nations in Chicago and the young men who fall victim to it. It's not going to be... It's about Diamond now. She was plotted to get information by any means necessary. Now, so far, she has not seen anything or heard anything yet. The advantage with Diamond is that he doesn't rush to make moves. He takes his time to make his decisions. These traits will make him not to sleep for this lady to get any info. Now, if she keeps sleeping with him and not getting any information as expected, she will start having feelings for Diamond and she will start comparing the person she knows to the person they painted to her for which was the reason she decided to do the job. And her feelings for him might make her stop looking for any debts on him because Diamond's action will make her feel like he's a good man. Now, what I see happening is that we all know Jenner and how he just picks on everybody and starts acting. This lady would rather have dirt on Jenner instead of Diamond. She will probably report back that Diamond is not the target that they are looking for, but rather his junior brother. I believe Jenner's action towards this lady when he finds out that his brother is smashing will make him a suspect to the lady. Are you saying this shit because you really not looking to expand? Or because you finally get some pussy on the regular and it's got your head all fucked up. Let me tell you, pussy, that shit come and go, nigga. But this shit right here, that shit change everything, nigga. Now, let me know your thoughts in the comment section about all the topics I talked about. I also want to apologize to you guys for posting late this week. I traveled and came back just yesterday just to prepare this video. Thank you all for the support and I always and truly appreciate your loyalty. If you like this video, kindly hit the subscribe button, like, share, and don't forget to leave your comments below. Catch you in my next video. It's your boy Nino. Thanks for watching.